Hello everyone, welcome back to Musha Slam. We're here, we got all the trials done in the last episode, and now we're off to, I want to say the real world, we're off to Toriel Island, as I call it. And that was an awful jump. Forgot, I keep forgetting, like the one thing that's getting me into a lot of trouble is I keep forgetting that there's no auto jump anymore, there's an actual designated button for jump now. So, uh, gotta keep my eyes open for that. Either way, we were told we're going to head over to Kakariko Village to go talk to Impa, who's the elder there, but um, well, I'm going to go do that because I'm going to do my best not to get too sidetracked as we go. I learned how to use um, amiibos, by the way, on my other character, and I'm going to avoid using them except for for essential stuff, and by essential stuff I mean like Character costumes and such, because that's what you can get with them. It's pretty cool. Uh, I will give you an example, but we have to get to a certain part in the game before that, I believe. So let me try. This episode's also going to be shorter, because as I'm recording right now, it's I've been struggling two hours to get my last video out and it was just over an hour for some reason whatever the switch likes to whatever my program likes to do with the switch recordings it's just not great like it takes a long time a very long time for it to process it all I guess so I'm gonna cut them shorter just so I can get more videos out quicker even if that means maybe whoa what oh hello I don't think I could fight you. I have trouble fighting normal guys. I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave you. Oh jeez. Hey, it says I'm in Lake Hylia North. Interesting. It's a good thing it moves really slow. Otherwise, it'd be a problem. Oh boy. Oh my gosh, he's still coming. I'm guessing I just need to, uh... Keep moving, because, oh man, I was not expecting that. Finding a random boss in the overworld. This is... Oh man, I'm cutting it close. I'm cutting it really close. Oh, made it. Where is he? I think he's that rock right there. Scary stuff. I was not expecting the rock to try and kill me. There's another big guy. Huh. Just bad news all over this place. Either way. Hello, Chew. Alright, so Kakariko Village is way the heck over there. We're gonna collect some stuff on the way there. And by collect stuff, I mean we're gonna go in these things. Because I, I honestly don't know where any set items are, I'm just... On my other character file, just so... You guys know how far I am, I have just made it to Kakarika Village. It's not far ahead. Probably not gonna... I'm probably gonna get further in the next two recordings I'm doing of this, which I'm going to be playing... Instead of my other character. If, okay, I don't know how to explain this. Basically what I'm saying is, I'm going to be recording now until I get past that point on this character. So it won't really matter that I'm ahead on the other character. Yep, same as always. Anyways. So, that's the thing. Oh, I remember this. Wind, Wind Waker. Oh. Once again, forgot there's a dedicated jump button. Okay, there we go. Wow. I did not do it well. Let's try that again. It's like I need to activate it at the height of my jump. 
There we go. Cool. I also found out that these ore, you sell them for stuff. And stuff is expensive. Oh my gosh. I, uh... Like I said, I just got a little bit further than I am right now. But, like... I made it to the first, like, store where you could buy gear. So that was pretty expensive. It's crazy. Looks like I'm gonna have to do mining to get some stuff. Oh, no! No! I forgot to aim for, like... Or I forgot to let go. I don't remember how to let go. Either way, I should probably eat something. And eat this steak. There we go. Okay, so how do I... There's a chest over there. And I don't fly far enough to get it from here. Huh. I'm not sure. I need to get higher, maybe? Oh, I know. Maybe I'm supposed to use this slipstream or airstream, whatever it's called. To get some lift. And then possibly not high enough. Nope. Oh, jeez. Well, that was awful. <laughs> Why is it whenever I start recording, suddenly I can't do anything? Oh, my gosh. Okay. Let's see. How can I eat? Let's eat these apples. No. Okay, I'm going to give up on that for now. And I totally give up on that for now and just get the thing. Because it seems as soon as I want to record, I can't do anything I want to do. I've never gotten that chest, mind you. But, like, shouldn't be that difficult to get. But for some reason, I just can't seem to pull off the maneuver. You already know what you say here, so I'll skip that. Wild horses. You can go and catch wild horses. And that's how you get your horse in the game. It's not like older games where you go and find a Pona. That being said, however, there is uh, there is still a way to get a Pona, which is pretty cool. Alright, so I'm out of there. I'll come back for you later, chest. Because I have a distinct feeling that I'm just not able to pull this off today. I'm just going to keep running. And I'm going to slow down. Oh yeah, didn't I say I was going to try and go straight to the end? What is that? How do I... That is a really big horse. Or dragon head made out of wood and such. Interesting. Well, I'm going to do something first. <coughs> I'm going to do something first, and then I'm going to go ahead and try and get to the end of the game from here. But I need to grab myself a horse, just because I have a feeling it's going to be way the heck over there. It's going to be a long walk. Looking to see if there's any good vantage points from here so I could jump and fly across the water. But it does not look like it. So it looks like we're gonna have to swim. Swimming's kind of scary. There we go. Just skipped a whole 
area of bad guys that are over there who would most likely kill me, but don't feel like doing that again today. I've fallen enough times already. Man, oh man. That's a big flag. I wonder what that's there for. Hopefully I don't run into any more, like, golems around here. Something tells me I'm probably going to need the bomb arrows to take that guy down. Which I don't think I have a lot of. So, I'll have to stock up on those and then come back for him later. Until then, we're going right over here to this tower. Oh, hey, look, a raft. Wonder if I can use it. Hey, actually, I wonder. Uh, I had a thing. Where was it? This. Oh, it totally works. I'm gonna come back to this. Tower first. Just so I have a fast travel point. Then we come back for this. There is a moblin, or, or bokoblin, whatever it's called over there. Oh, hello, guys. Did not, did not mean to do that. I am in a bad place right now. Oh. -ho. I need to go. Can't climb slow. Got stuff to do. Oh, hey, look. I can stop for this. Oh, wrong one. I can always stop for money. Oh, they're throwing stuff at me. I swim really slow. Oh, hey, I can bomb this get far enough away. Oh. Oh, wrong one. Nope. Where's the bombs? There's the bombs. Ow, what? Who's throwing stuff? Yeah, a spear. My inventory is full. Fantastic. We're gonna go up here. Well, whatever was throwing stuff at me has stopped, which is nice. No! Well, at least I didn't fall all the way down. Go away. Go away. Why can't I hit this? Oh my gosh, why am I just... There. 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 Leave me alone. I'm trying to climb a tower here. Come on, get up there. I'm just gonna hurry this up. There we go. All right. 
So the tower is activated. It goes all nice and blue looking. And we get our fast travel point. Scanning area. I've now unlocked the entire map of this area. I got the Sheikah sensor, which will now detect those uh, trial places. All right. Now we're gonna continue. Okay, can I move? All right. So that beeping noise just indicates that it's uh, working. I'm heading in the right direction, I guess. That's what it means. Oh, I gotta stop. I gotta stop. These things are worth money. I haven't found a lot of rupees lying around. Ooh, almost lost that. So I found that these are pretty much my sole source of income. Which I'm okay with, because I don't mind mining, as long as the resources don't dry up super quickly. Oh, wait. That is not something to be smacked with a hammer. Let's put that away. Do some sprinting. What? What's that? Oh, lovely. Oh, let's not run into those guys. Or do our best not to run into them anyway. Let's head over to this shrine. Okay, so this is an interesting trial. Okay, I'm gonna skip you again, because you don't do anything. Uh, timing is critical, which is a subtle hint. Oh, I don't need that. I need this, stasis. Got it. So, these trials have been fairly simple so far, but I have a feeling they are going to pick up. Just not yet. I am technically still right in the beginning of the game. In fact, I haven't even finished the tutorial-ish yet. Uh, stop it. There we go. Looks like I can stop these platforms in midair, which is nice. Uh, let's see. Oh, I gotta make a jump. There we go. First try. Oh! Great. Messed it up. Great. Fantastic. Oh, there's the treasure chest. Oh, I think I know what I need to do. Crap. 
I meant to... That was not the best way of doing that. This is what I needed. I'm just gonna wait for it to recharge now. Come on, come on. Come on, go platform, go platform. Oh, probably could have done that better. Made it though. Climber's bandana. Increases climb speed. But more importantly, increases armor. There we go. So I'm gonna wear this. Now I climb better, I guess. Guess I didn't need to get that extra stamina. But I'm sure it'll come in handy later anyway. Uh, skip you. Yay, Spirit Orb. Alright. Well, seeing as we're almost at 25 minutes, I think I'll just call it here. And the next episode we'll pick it up again and we'll just, uh... I don't know. We'll pick it up where we left off. So, I will see you guys all in the next episode. I hope you guys have a good evening. Goodbye.